guys my name is Alicia and I'm gonna be showing you guys a unit today from Nadula.com so if you're interested in anything that you're seeing in this video definitely check down below in the description box where everything will be linked for you guys of course some coupon codes everything will be linked for you guys in the description box but Nadula decided to send me a unit this time around this is their 4x4 lace closure ready to wear air wig so you guys can see it is their kinky curly texture and it does have that 4x4 inches of parting space now this is a ready to go unit so that lace is pre-cut and this unit does have the elastic band as well as the slip grip on the back of the unit and this is their air wig so this kind of has like the same construction as one of the beauty supply store wigs so you're not going to become overheated by wearing this unit this is a ready to go unit now I did speak with the company and they asked for me to not do any customizing to this not even washing the hair because they wanted you guys to see just how quick and easy and versatile this unit is as well as I wanted the youtuber to not change the way the wig looks because there's this huge confusion that youtubers are getting better things however the companies believe that the youtubers are changing the way the unit looks I don't know you guys let me know now you guys can see how the hair comes directly out of the box these are the curls that you're going to get this is their kinky curly jerry curly unit 150% density and I do believe the inch that I have mine in is a 20 inch but I just couldn't resist I had to tint that lace because after I tried it on the lace was just too light for my complexion so I decided to take my liquid foundation and place that on the lace and I also seal it in so that it doesn't transfer with some hairspray and look y'all it looks like I bleached the knots it looks like I tinted the lace and I just added foundation it's a win-win for me but I'm going to go ahead and get the unit on so you guys can see how it looks. Now the fit of this wig is really comfortable. I really love the fact that they have that slip grip on the back side. So that's an A plus for me. But this is how the unit looks now that I have it on. You guys can see just how those knots look. But I do notice that at the edges of the lace it is like this little piece that I just want to cut off I don't think it's necessary to have it there because if the wind blows you're going to see it so I just went ahead and snipped it off now as far as the wig hump because all wigs kind of have a hump that's why I love washing my units because it gets rid of it but because I didn't wash this one I am going to take a bit of my wax and my hot comb just to flatten the top of the wig I know it looks like there's a lot of product in my hair and the top looks really flat but we're going to work it out in a bit but I am going to take some concealer just to define that parting space and clean it up a bit and also I am going to adhere this unit down typically I do not adhere the closure units down but I'm going to do this one because I kind of felt like the lace kept flipping up so what I just did is take my bedhead hard hat mini hairspray and apply that to my forehead and then put the lace on top and it was a perfect hole now because that lace is still kind of rolling and I don't want to do too much I'm going to create just a little bit of baby hairs just a little swoop in the front nothing too major it's giving eyelashes but it's okay we're gonna work it out <laughs> right now i'm just gonna go through the hair and manipulate it to get those curls to drop a bit Okay, so this is how the hair it's looking now that I've manipulated a little bit but kept it in its original form. Let me know how you guys are feeling about this. I feel like the curls are still very much like in the box and everything kind of still looks the way it originally came. But here are the angles of the hair. Again, this unit is I believe 20 inches. The density is 150% and this is where it falls on me. I am 5 foot 8 and it falls just right into my boob area. But right here, I am just going to throw this wig in a couple of styles. This unit is very versatile, so let me know what style you guys come up with. But also let me know if you guys like any of these.
right here i wanted you guys to see how the hair looked after i customized it myself i washed it i bleached the knots i tweezed the front hairline you guys can see how much more potential this hair has so all in all i do believe that this is the perfect throw on and go lace closure unit for those of you guys who do not want to have to customize or wash your unit straight out of the box tweeze that front hairline or even bleach those knots it is super quick and it's easy and you guys don't have to do what other youtubers do again y'all this comes from nadula.com let me know what you guys think of this one and i will catch you guys later bye